sweetheart. Hello. Gotta get used to these doors. You should have been there at rehearsal. You'd have liked it. You got a few new songs in the can? Oh, good. Yeah. Tiffany was there, too. She wants to do a piece on me and Kate. She wants to call it How Love of Home and Family Brought Two Talented People Together. Hmm? I love it. Robert loved it, too. Spent all afternoon there staring at Kate. Couldn't get rid of him. It's all perfect, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Everybody's lives are just finally coming together. Robert's and Catherine's, yours and mine, and even Anna and Robin's. Why does that face? You know me. I know it's kind of crazy, but when things start to get a little too happy, I get nervous. Honey, stop. I hate vegetables. Listen, we deserve to be happy. Do you know what we've been through? Now, I'm going to sit back and enjoy this. Care to join me? the hell hit this place? Where'd all this water come from? God. Where's everybody? Look, let's split up and have a fly. search, all right? Yeah. You take over there, I'll take over here. Yeah, well, I'll go down here. here. What happened? Yes. Uh, all right. Uh, uh, Katie, is that... Smart Alex. Sure. You mark one little smirk. So help me, I'm going to strangle you. What happened? I, 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 I don't even know what happened. You're the one that never leaves the job until it's finished, right? What's that got to do with this? I stayed here just to make sure that everything would be perfect for tonight's performance. Well, what went wrong? I'm in my dressing room, going over my lyrics. All of a sudden, the sky is falling. The entire ceiling caves in on me. It was so funny. Tons of water drenched over the entire place. I, I guess the whole, the, the old plumbing in this place just couldn't take it. The main pipes just burst upstairs. How much damage do you think? It's, it's pretty bad. Uh, no one knew what was going on until we heard the crash in Kate's dressing room. Oh, and uh, she started screaming. Uh, Kate, you're all right, though, right? Yeah, mm. I'll be fine as soon yeah. as I dry off. How long will you have to close down? Well, it'll be for a while. But I've got everyone on staff upstairs trying to clean up so that ceilings won't cave in. Well, give me a sponge and I'll help anything. To yeah, I'll, I'll help. If we can use all the help we can get. Yeah. You know, I better go check the instruments upstairs. Yeah, I'm sorry. No, no, hard. The two of you worked on your... Don't get that on April showers. <laughs> well, the instruments are pretty well gone. The scores are ruined. Oh, dear. That water could cause this much damage under the floors, the ceiling, everything. You know, somebody Good. better call Terry. I just got off the phone with her. Mm -hmm. She feels terrible. She told me to go ahead and make the adjustments and the repairs and send her the bills. Oh, poor Terry, I feel terrible. Uh, what are you going to do uh, until this club is reopened? Oh, don't worry about me. I've got plenty to keep me busy. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, Mary, maybe you should call Donate up and we can reschedule that concert that I had done. Wait, wait. What concert was this? Uh, I had, I had set up a concert for right after the honeymoon, which is, would have been right about now, and, um, so anyway, would you call him up and maybe we could Mary, schedule Mary, uh, please, just hold off for a second, will you? This is what I want to do every evening for the rest of my life. You get bored. You think so? Things will never be as exciting as when we were in Europe together. <laughs> ah, Europe, Europe. Europe wasn't any fun. It was a terrible honeymoon for you. I want to spend my days from now on making up for lost time. Are you forgetting something? Hmm. I have a job. I've been meaning to talk to you about that. I think it's a good idea that out-of-work musicians, that they make sure that their wives have a job. Thanks, babe. What are you going to be doing with yourself while I'm at work? Doing? Uh-huh. Honey, I'm now a house husband. You do that? Do that? What's the big deal? I mean, you go shopping, you pay the bills, you set your hair at night and watch TV. You'd really 
really do that? Oh, honey, come on. I've had it with the guns, the running around, the chasing, all of that. Housekeeping is my life. Oh, sure, I can see it now. You work your fingers to the bone, and then when I come home, you're too tired to move. Wanna bet? Housework is hard work, and honey, you're not up to it. Well, it may take a little practice. I mean, I may not be three meals a day right off the bat. I may burn a supper or two. No more than me. Which is my point exactly here. But besides that, I want to make one thing perfectly clear from the beginning. Even though I might have an awful day, very strenuous, I promise you I will not be one of those house husbands who says, not tonight, honey, I have a headache. migraine I felt coming on earlier. I think it's going away. 